It's, it's those special women in your life. They deserve better than being the objects of violence. And so the message for men and for boys is look after them because violence won't be tolerated. And today we're going to march and send a message that we won't tolerate that violence against our women. And it's important that all men understand and we all pledge to make sure we never ever do that. We're getting ready for the White Ribbon March. The crowd is getting bigger and the excitement is building. There's a whole range of different people here, all joining to support the cause. We believe it's a very important cause. It's simply unacceptable violence against women. We want to support the other community leaders and people in our community. When you look at domestic violence, it's something that impacts on everyone. The reason I'm here today is obviously as part of my job at the GWS Giants to support a great cause. Mate, uh, I'm the manager of the Domestic and Family Violence Team from New South Wales Police. Why are you here today, mate? Oh, I'm here to join in the march for uh, the Violence Against Women, the White Ribbon Day. Do you think today is an important day? Absolutely. I think it gives an opportunity for the community to come together. And it's a really great opportunity for us to stand up and say violence against someone's unacceptable. Today is a fantastic success. Looking around here at the people who have turned up, looking around here at, uh, at the community coming together to send a very clear message that violence will not be tolerated and we can't remain silent. So are you ready to walk the talk? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I've got my shoes on, ready to go. Welcome to the second annual White Ribbon March of Lakemba. This is um, this is the second year this has been, event has been conducted. Haven't we come a long way since uh, since last year? These people are the ones who have made it happen, and for that I'm very grateful. By marching this evening, by coming down in here to Parry Park, every man here committed that he will never commit, excuse, or remain silent. Well, what a fantastic turnout! This is my first year within White Ribbon Australia. And talking to the team as we walk down Halden Street, they've said to me this is the biggest march they've seen. I have a special woman in my life who I love and it makes hard for me to accept the fact that one in three Australian women will be assaulted or abused in their lifetime. In the end it'll be the community that stops this problem and to look out and see so many people representing so many different communities across Western Sydney uh, gives you great hope that we can put an end to it. And for us it's about the Bulldogs taking the opportunity to step up and say this is not acceptable and we want to not only do work within our own environment but also in the Canoe Bankstown area. You are a living, breathing human being. If only you knew what you mean you would understand that every girl in the world is capable of being a queen. So Sergeant Daddy, how was the day today? Uh, absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Inspiration, as always. What's amazing is that we've got bands, we've got the Bulldogs, we've got the Giants, we've got community people, the most senior people from council, lots of politicians, and importantly, uh, senior people from the police force, and young men like yourselves. Wonderful day. Brings everyone together, the community, the police, and uh, everyone. I think it was amazing. Amazing event. Uh, well organised, well prepared. I'm very proud to be a part of the White Ribbon campaign for 2014. Uh, mate, speechless. Thank you. How did the day go today? Well, I think you can see by the, the group of people behind us how, how the day went. I'm so, so especially pleased and humbled by the representation today from the variety of community groups. Together, we can beat this. We can stop this. We can get that message out there. We owe it to those that we're called to protect men. 
It's time for men to be real men and uh, I think we can join together and we can send that message and thank you very much for coming and joining us tonight. I'm really honoured and certainly privileged to be part of this. Thank you. Thank you, Commissioner.